Alright, welcome back to Cherry Tree High Comedy Club. So today we're gonna do some signs, as I said last time. It's been a very long time since I played, as always. Always, it's always a long time since I played. So I don't remember, I think, what was on TV was like music and it was bad. Yeah, so I don't want that, so I'm just gonna reset quick. And we're gonna do some homework. And then, well I guess it doesn't really matter because I'm gonna reset anyways, but... Let's just do homework, because why not? So, at first, I'm gonna get started right away here, because otherwise I'm gonna be here recording for quite a while, because what I want to do now is to just go through every single topic with May again, because there are some that I'm not too sure about, that I've marked down as questionable and all this sort of stuff. So, I'm just gonna go through all of this and do the classic cutting thing, so we'll get concrete evidence for everything. Video games! Arc? Oh, neutral. Never mind, they're neutral. Yay! And as always, I'll probably check the uh, chit-chat topics, and I actually think this one might be new. At least, I don't remember reading this, so... I was wondering what club to join in high school. I won't be able to decide if I leave it... If I leave it too soon... too late. I leave it too late. Wouldn't that be like, leave it for too late? I don't know, that doesn't make any... I don't know, grammar, it's hard. It's okay for you, sis. You're talented enough for any club. I sure am. Look at these skill levels in repertoire. I'm not gonna go there because it's gonna waste time. Let's just go! So, who done it? Neutral. Music should be bad. It's bad. Alright. She sucks. Art should be neutral. It's neutral. Huh, I'm not sure about this. I have a goldfish, but I'm not that interested in animals. Maybe I should try keeping a tortoise. I'm I'm not sure if I read that, and it's kind of weird, like this is what I'm talking about. So, pets are actually good on May. It's a good topic, and yet here she's saying she's not interested in animals for some reason. But I mean, I guess it's just pets because she likes like, likes like, like, like? Kitties and doggies and puppies and whatnot, I don't even know, but it really is kind of strange how they can say one thing and then it doesn't really translate into the the likes and dislikes, even though some other things do. It's just I don't know. History is good. And politics are bad. Romance should be bad as well. It is bad. Alright, so, fashion. This is the one that I haven't noted anything down for, or on, at, to, in, I don't know, but I don't think... I think I've already used it at some point, but I just didn't write it down, maybe. So let's just see. It's neutral. Alright, cool. So from here on, I actually do know all of these. Sports should be good, travel should be good, pets should be good, and cooking should be neutral. But I'm, I guess I'm just gonna keep going with this to have a comprehensive list and everything in video form. So sports are good. Travel is good. Yep. Pets are good as well. Indeed they are. And finally, right? I did pets? I think I did pets. So cooking is neutral. Yep. And that's kind of interesting, because that, that turns out, it turns out that May does not have a single great topic, but on the other hand, she has four good topics. So she's like more broad-minded, but then again, she has three bad topics. So overall, she just has less neutral topics, which is kind of interesting that different characters have different amounts of likes and dislikes, and how much they like them and stuff like that. It's pretty cool, so... May is good to try and recruit if you've got a lot of repertoire levels in a lot of things, instead of like specializing in one one or two things, in which case someone like Cindy might be pretty nice, because she has great in music and fashion and good in video games or something like that. I don't even know. So, let's just reset again. And now... We're gonna do the same thing, or I'm gonna do the same thing, and this is gonna take ages, so this might get... This might end up being a pretty short episode, but I'll record a bit extra as usual, 
and we'll just see if it's either really short or really long. Probably really short. But yeah, so we're gonna do the same thing, and then we're gonna find out every single topic that Tyler likes. Or, what was his, his name? Something... she, or... hmm, I really cannot remember. Let's, let's find out. Yoshiki, right, okay. And yep, yeah, this is not new, so let's just go for it. Let's go through all of them. Video games! New- oh, no, never mind, I was gonna say neutral, but he likes them. He likes video games, so that's good. Whodunits? He doesn't like whodunits, alright. And music, I've written down as good, question mark, so we'll see. He likes music, cool. Well, here we go! That's kind of interesting, so I just got the music thing, and apparently I've seen this. Apparently I had written down that he likes music, but I don't remember listen or uh, reading this, but maybe that's just because the the localization, I'm not sure, but you can probably tell, but I listen to a lot of music, because, right, he has, like, earphones, I didn't even... that did not even click in my mind that those are earphones. Okay. What kind do you like? Stuff like Shogo Hamada. I'm not sure who that is, but again, kind of interesting way the way they did the localization, because it really did make more sense. I wasn't too keen on it at first when I found out that, oh, they translated all the names into, like, Miley and Tyler and all those, like, generic English, or not English, but American names and stuff like that, but when, when it comes to things like this, it really does make sense that they localized it into something that more of the Western world know about and stuff like that, because I have no idea who, who this is, and I bet most of you probably don't. So, kind of interesting there, but yeah, it's it's just interesting. That's uh, unusual. I have stacks of music CDs. What Would you like to borrow some? He likes music. I've already noted that. So, art, I've already written down as bad, so I guess we tried this at some point. Yep, it's bad. All right. And history, I have not noted anything down for this. It's neutral. Okay, this is a new thing as well, and I don't even really understand it, so here we go. It took all night for me to enter the information you gave me into the Future Stars of Cherry Tree database. But I enjoy doing it. Future Stars of Cherry Tree? Let me see it. I'm giving you the info, so you should at least let me have a look. I'm not sure what that even means. When did I give him... Info? Just... I don't even know. But anyways, let's talk about politics. They should be bad? No, I wrote down bad, but they're just neutral. So I guess it was one of those things where he was like, I don't like politics, but it didn't actually say that he didn't like politics. Yeah. Alright, here we go. Romance should be one of his great topics. Maybe his only great topic. Let's see. He is a huge romance fan. Told you. And fashion, let's see. He... no, it's just neutral. And sports... are neutral. Travel, I've written down as good, but it's neutral. Pets are neutral. And here's another chit-chat topic we haven't read. According to my sources, Yoriko, which is Sarah if you didn't know, has a little brother. Also, she secretly secretly likes to watch anime and draws anime characters. Wah, that's not so much taking an interest as full-on stalking. Yeah, he is. He is kind of borderline there. And cooking is finally neutral. Alright, so there we go, and that did actually bring us up. So that's kind of cool that a neutral topic brings us to level 1. So maybe I should just do that. Maybe I should just do that. Maybe I should just go with this. I've already done homework, so I might as well. Let's just go with this. Let's continue. And yeah, I I have actually recorded the entirety of like an episode, but I'm going to cut this down and it would be really boring to end it off like this, just doing this. So I'll do at least like one or two of these uh, new level thingies. Yo, 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 yo. How's it going? What did you call me? Guess what I decided? You can be the CTHCC manager. Huh? What? What makes you think I'd have any interest in that? Consider it an honor. Yo-yo, you... what? Oh. Oh, I see. Oh, that's... hmm. I wonder what... Does she say, like, 
Tai Tai? Mai Tai? I don't even know, that... I kinda wanna find out what she says in the uh, non-localized, or in the localized version for that, but... Yo-Yo, you have a knack for reading people and their talents. I'm glad you recognize my management potential. But my services don't come cheap. What's in it for me? You can help me find the next generation Grinmeisters. Ah, I see. I presume they'd all be in comedy. We're gonna be the second generation of Grinmeisters. Comedy, huh? Well, comedy certainly is hot right now, and sharp-witted celebs are, or celebs are quite marketable. And female celebs even more so. So who did you have in mind? Um, well, there's Yoriko Nagewa, who's the girl next door type. The girl who just moved here? I haven't been able to check her out yet, but I'd like to find out about her, about her, even though he just told us that he had like a lot of info and she had a little brother and all that stuff. There's the sweet and lovable face of mom and pop rock candy, Amana Inubo. The candy store girl, huh? I thought she was still in grade school, but I guess she'll be moving up to our school soon. There's the white-haired wild child, Haru Mitsuki, who can crush you with her, with her mad taekwondo kicks, or skills. You got her to join? Her band is pretty popular, too. She's definitely one to keep an eye on. There's the natural-born comedian who pretends to hate comedy in public, Shinosuke Kamikata. I see now. You re research your targets as, as thoroughly as I do mine. And there's Hoemi. I see. Well, if they're all on board, you have yourself a deal. Yay, awesome! You have a variety of personalities, that's good. Well, we need a selection with something for everyone. No, 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 you have to consider each member's individual strengths. It, it'll be slow going otherwise. Oh, I see, I see. It's great to hear our stalker manager really knows his stuff. You can drop the stalker. To be honest, I've been making the rounds of the school clubs myself. And it's about time I decided one on one to join. It seems like fate, doesn't it? Not so fast there. This is still a gamble for me. A little honey would sweeten the deal. As in, a bribe? I did say that. Ah, you're trying to get Hoemi's phone number out of me, aren't you? I see we're on the same page. Mayuru exchanged Hoemi's phone number for Yoshiki's. Great. Don't you dare misuse that. Of the two of us, you're far more likely to abuse the numbers we just traded. Either way, my club's gonna take off. You'll see. Can we? Can you really afford to miss this chance? Okay, okay, I'll think about it. Keep your hopes high and your expectations low. And a few, and a few more cute members couldn't hurt. Hmm. So I'm kind of interested in, in that as well. Like, what happens if you already have all the members? Then would he say something else? Instead of a few more cute members? Or maybe he's just saying that regardless. I don't even know. Next, Mayu will see what happens when the candidates or candidates meet Yoshiki. So there we go, I guess since I'm going with this, I'll just run around and collect stuff. Maybe I shouldn't even do that. It's kind of pointless. Should I? Ah... Uh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I shouldn't. It's it's just kind of a waste of time, but at least I'm gonna go talk to uh, Elise, because she's she's nice. Regulars. Right, yeah, that's, that's nothing new. Oh, there's a thing. Empty bottle. How many have I found now? That's a lot of empty bottles. I have only four, never mind. Maybe I've been resetting a lot. So, where would Tyler be at this hour? Is he... Uh, no. That's... we read that. Is he in the shopping dis precinct? Maybe? I can't remember. No, he's not here. I mean, I know he... He's at the, uh, the port garden, but that's not even open yet, so... Is he just gone? Can we not hang out with Tyler on the afternoons at all? Because that's kind of weird. Empty bottle again. Yeah, Tyler is just gone. That's not fun. Okay, so I guess we can't get Tyler right away. That's a bit unfortunate. So... Hmm... Oh, and also, I forgot, I should be reading these. I keep forgetting about everything that I should be doing. So, 
Shinosuke, I think we read. Yeah, I knew it. He was the son. Hooray. And Yoshiki, let's just read this. Uh... I think this hasn't changed. I don't think this has changed. But I'm not sure. So... Hmm. So he's just gone. So that's a problem. So I guess I'll just hang out with Curtis instead and advance that that thing one more level. Right? That's pretty much the best thing I can do. Yeah, let's let's do that, I guess. Yoshiki was snooping around. Yep, we, we know that. So yeah, I guess... What should I talk about with him? What have I talked about? I've talked about whodunits, and that's it. So, I'll talk about... what does he like? He likes whodunits, he likes politics, he likes cooking. I guess I should just talk about cooking or something. Let's just do that. Hooray! So, I mean... Yeah, I've read all this already, so I'm just gonna skip this and I'll meet you on the other side. Alright, so let's talk to Homi. She's still twisting her ankles and stuff all, all day long. So let's save, and I'll just check what's on TV. It's politics. I don't need politics because I'm already level 5, I'm pretty sure. Am I level 5? I think I'm level 5. Oh, and also, as you can see, I decided to save over the uh, New Game Plus save because, as always, I've already got backups of them, so I don't need to not use those slots, so I'm just using the first and second one, as I have been doing. So, Repertoire, I think I'm level 5 in politics. Yes, I am. So, we're gonna do the last bit of homework now, and that's... that's cool, I suppose. And yeah, I'll do... I'll do one more. It's very late... Wait, what is this? Oh, it's the port garden opening! I see! That's kind of unfortunate, so now we can't find out any more interesting things about, like, the events that happen before Port Garden is open, but I guess it's still good because then we can talk to Tyler two times this, this day, which I guess I'll have to do. As I said, might be a very long episode in the end because I'm already up to, like, 30, 30 minutes, even though I am gonna cut it down a lot. We'll see. Oh, shit! I just realized! I want to read this! I kind of want to read this, because this is like about Ravian, or Vivian, whatever. Because she's Canadian now, so all the like Canadian puns instead of Swedish puns. So, I'm gonna reset and we're gonna actually read this. Not all of it, but I'll just skim through it and I guess I'll show you something if I see anything interesting. So yeah, let's do that instead. Yeah, here we go, here's something. I was surprised the museum head gave a speech in Japanese, even though he's Canadian. And he tried to make a few jokes. American jokes are a little tough for a Japanese audience, I guess. Alright. So, so far nothing really out of the ordinary, just changing Canada to Sweden, or vice versa. So, I mean, I guess, I won't forget your kindness, I guess she is gonna talk the exact same way because it's just translated from Japanese, like, she has stilted Japanese, not stilted English, really, so, even though they are speaking in English for the translated version, they're just gonna say, oh, your, your Japanese is really good, I guess. Hmm, so the, the like... The way she's speaking won't be any difference, but still the, the puns and stuff and references might be different, so we'll, we'll try that. And Japanese joke! A Japanese joke! Yeah, exactly. I can see you two like to be making jokes, certainly. Like, it's... It's just the same. Ravian Mary. Mary, huh? Like the one with the lamb? That's new. That's... is it? Wait. Was she called Vivian Mary? I don't think so. I don't even know. You are being so good at these play on plays on words. Your Japanese is good. Big fan of Japan. Marion.
Alright, so nothing else there. I guess what I really wanted to see was, like, in... I think it was either chit-chatting or just when they went to the cafe or something. I, I'm not sure, but... Holy crap, that took my entire morning. Damn it, game. That's, that's so cheap. Alright, so... I guess I'm not gonna run around or do anything. Let's just get this over with, and I'll just chit-chat. Yeah, Poemi is gonna... You, you have to watch her. So let's just hang out and see what we should talk about. Let's talk about... I talked about cooking, and that's advanced it. Let's talk about video games, because those are apparently good. Damn it! Huh. I mean, I guess I could... No, I couldn't talk about romance, because romance is... I'm really bad at romance. Huh. So I guess I don't really have much choice but to spend two time slots advancing him. It shouldn't be a problem in the end, since I'm not really grinding stats now. I should be able to get all of them, even if I have to take two times for, well, not every single thing, but, like, every now and then I have to do two... two hanging out thingies at once, basically, is what I'm trying to say. So, sorry for starting and stopping all the time, I, I have hiccups, and it's making commentary pretty hard. But yeah, that's... I think that's gonna be it for this episode. As I said, now I didn't actually have a, an event for that, that thing, just talking to, to Tyler didn't advance, so... Maybe it will end up being not a really all that long episode that made grammatical sense. But we'll see, I guess. I've recorded for long enough, that's for sure, so I'm gonna end it here, and... I guess I'll see after I edit it, and when you're watching this, we'll see how it all went. Great! So, thanks for watching, and I hope you enjoyed this episode, and next time, we'll just continue on with Tyler and hopefully recruit him, maybe, or something like that. I'm not sure how long it's gonna take. So yeah, I'll see you then. Bye-bye.